All right, what's up, everybody? Let's look at Vagabond Trial Normal Mode. We are going to be rocking the new treasure. We're going to be rock rocking the little, like, herbal tea treasure and the legend. Now, obviously, if you don't have the legend, you're going to have to switch it out. I think they recommend, the initial recommendation was the purple bear. So feel free to give that a go. Uh, overall, trial, I always say it, but it wasn't that difficult. Apart from my own lack of skill, uh, in missing three jellies. Now, I don't know whether these um, little cookies here are running away from something or they're running towards me because I'm such a lovable vagabond. They're like, oh my god, is it the vagabond cookie? I can't wait to go and see him. Ooh. And so, yeah. I, or we're just going to, you know what? Let's just set the whole place on fire. How about that? You see these birds? Burn birds. You see those, <laughs> you see those innocent bystanders? Burn them. Yeah, burn them all. Yeah. Yeah, nothing survives and when the Vagabond Cookie's around. <laughs> Brutal. I love it. I lo I'm here to sit. I'm here for it. I just noticed that the, the pet, really, when it's wagging its tail, it looks like it's smacking the drum <laughs> at the bottom. <laughs> That's adorable. Oh, I never noticed that before. Hey, hey, hey. So, we got to, one thing you've got to be careful about in this this particular trial, and that is when obstacles up here are destroyed, the like, little bear... I want to call them bushes. They release jellies. They release bear jellies and coins and maybe normal uh, bears as well. But they are all magnetic within a small range. They they will they're not massively magnetic, but they are magnetic within a certain range. And so make sure to be you know sliding, jumping, uh, in order to get the most out of it. I think that is where you will make or break your score pretty much. I was about, I missed a, a selection of uh, pink bears down there. I thought the little black hole might suck it up. Here, I waited so I could get the most out of the jellies. There is a lot of large potions in this run. I like, I was surprised that we're at 300 million. We're still, we're only at half health just because of this sheer amount of large potions. Does this cookie have a like a an increased energy drain or something? That there were so many large potions. I think there was like what four or five large potions. Plus I remember one small one. And it was pretty it was pretty incredible. I was like wow there's a small one. And I it was just pretty wowzers the amount of a large potions in this one. It could be the fact that the, the skill seems to take quite a while to charge. So they... Oh, here's another big potion. Look at that. Oh, wowzers. And so, you know, they've had to add it in so that the you've actually got some time. So unfortunately, right there, as you can see, it does destroy stuff which is in the back of you as well. You're not going to be getting that really unless there's some kind of like godly aim. There I did a bit of a risk jump to get the uh, what's it called to get the those jellies. Risk myself some ba basic bears. I, basic jellies. I think that's a worth the risk. But we had a lot of health left. So I'm feeling like a couple falls could potentially work out in your favor right here. That was those jellies there that we didn't collect. I reckon a couple of falls push yourself forward. So providing you're not missing any health potions, it could benefit you. Like, comment, and subscribe. Do you have any tips for me to improve my run? I'd love to hear them. Until next time, bye-bye.